Police in Pueblo say a motel in the city is now inhabitable after multiple health violations were found inside. Officers say they were at the roadway in off Highway 50 for a multi-agency investigation into criminal activity and business practices at the motel. News 5's Maggie Bryan was at the scene this afternoon. Maggie, residents living there were told they have to find another place to stay tonight. Diane, many of those residents called that motel home, and today the health department told me the rooms inside are not made to support long-term stays. A number of concerns are drawing authorities to the roadway in off Highway 50 in Pueblo. People loitering, people using drugs, people uh, breaking into cars. We've had at least one murder here, if not two, recently. Pueblo police say officers have been dealing with a lot of crime at the motel over the past year. Where it got really bad to where we started getting complaints from neighboring businesses. They say three people were arrested today for criminal activity, but an annual health inspection revealed more problems inside the motel rooms. A number of sanitary concerns like trash and cleanliness as a whole didn't lend itself to a healthy stay for the patrons. The health department says some residents had been staying long term in rooms that weren't meant for that. Health officials consider a long term stay to be more than four days. Trudy Pacheco says she's been staying at the motel for two and a half years. Now she and every other resident have to find another place to stay after police ruled the motel inhabitable. It's unfair that we are being uprooted and kicked to a curb because of a few people who um, cause problems here. Pacheco says she believes those who bring criminal activity to the motel are to blame for this situation. The fentanyl problem, everyone around here who lives here, who actually live here, we chase them away. We're not into the drugs. The people that come here, that bring it here, they're not really welcome. Police say the owner of the motel is under investigation as well. In the meantime, the future of the roadway inn is unclear as officers plan to execute more search warrants inside the rooms. I'm told nonprofits are working together to help residents find another place to stay tonight.